Post-game wrap-up here with head coach Nick Bootlin after Kalamazoo's 6-5 victory over the Cincinnati Cyclones on the 8th annual Orange Ice Game here at Wing Stadium. And coach, 6-5 wasn't the outcome that you expected, was it? No, I mean, uh, you know, I think we were lucky in the first period right off the bat to be up 2-1. Uh, they came out with guns and blazing. And, you know, we were sat back and we were on our heels and we were to play our game. Um, and we are very opportunistic in the second period. You know, we didn't, we, the chances we had, pretty much every chance we had, we scored. Um, th those were nice plays that we made, uh, but we still didn't have a solid period in the second, even though we, we scored that many goals, um, scoring the four goals. And then uh, we go to the third period, and that's certainly not the type of hockey we want to play. You know, we have a 6-2 lead, and we go in. Uh, we don't want to finish like that. You know, it was the first time this year that we really uh, uh, played that poorly for so long. The main issue was staying out of the box for you guys in the third period. Over the course of the game, you guys racked up 50 minutes of penalties. They scored four power play goals in the third period. How does that deflate you guys? Um, yeah, we knew they were going to be prepared. We knew they were going to be ready. They, uh, they've only played three games all year. And we knew they were going to make some tweaks. And, and, and we were having a tough time in the neutral zone. You know, we made three adjustments as the, as the night went on, uh, trying to counter their breakouts because they were having success getting in the zone untouched and, and getting puck retrieved, uh, pucks retrieved for them. So uh, we, we struggled there, and then they had us in our zone for so long that we didn't have a choice but to box it up because our guys were getting so tired, and they didn't do anything uh, uh, innovative. So they just did it simple. They had guys in front of the net. Um, and, and got pucks through. Goaltenders couldn't see out Mandis in front and just kept throwing pucks there and, and making it difficult for us. I know you're all business all the time, but I find it hard to believe that you didn't glance out into the stands at least once at all the Halloween costumes you saw out there. If you did, what was your favorite one? If not, we'll just let it go. Well, I, I was walking around before the game started, and the concourse was full, and uh, I had seen the little bitty sloppy up there again, and I thought we said that one's a, a start of one. And, um, you know, the fans were great tonight. It was an unbelievable atmosphere for us, and uh, another success for our Jersey. Well, Coach Bullen, thanks a lot for your time. Thanks, guys.